Good morning everyone, I am Dhananjay Kumar and I am MVP on Connected System. In this uh, uh, tutorial video, I am going to show you that how we can return an image using our WCF REST service. So to do so, just go ahead and open your Visual Studio from open your Visual Studio and create a new project. From WCF tab, select WCF service application and if you are using Visual Studio 2008 select, uh, you will be getting this WCF service application of um, project template inside the web tab. So go ahead and create and just give some meaningful name, let us say get my image or something. What I am going to do is that I am going to return an image which is on my hard drive uh, using uh, WCF REST service. Now if you see that uh, by default WCF has created some code for us which we really don't need, let's go ahead and delete those code, WCF created for you. Now I'm going to create an operation contract and method which will be returning image for us. So just get an operation contract. Let us say get image. Fine. The return type of operation contract would be a string because you want to return an image. Uh, whenever you want to return an image or media file, the return type should be image. So for to work with image, go ahead and add a system.io image classes inside this system.io namespace and then return a stream now since this is a wcf rest service we are going to uh, we need to construct uh, the uri for that and this web gate and just say uri template equal to let us say get image how to construct URI template and how to work with URI template and all for all uh, uh, detailed description on that you can see my uh, other tutorial videos or you can uh, read my articles on the same blog. So here I have constructed operation contract which is going to return us an, a simple stream that is still will be containing the image and here in webgate I have constructed a URI which is saying that I am going to access this particular resource or method of the service using the base address slash get image. Now just go ahead and implement this inside your service class. For that again you need to include the namespace system dot io. Now here our method name is stream get image and this is public make it public and first what we need to do is that we need to open the file stream file stream let us say fs equal to file open file dot open read it will be returning an stream to us fine and from where so we want to read it the from D drive and a.jpg file which I want to read it. If you see in my uh, D drive I can show you that I have that a.jpg file over here. I'm going to return this uh, using our WCF service. Now just return this stream. Now the problem is that we need to tell explicitly to uh, our uh, we need to tell explicitly to in our WCF service that we are going to uh, return an image. So for that web operation contacts, just go to web operation contacts, then in current in order response dot content, we need to explicitly say that the content type is image slash jpeg so here we are uh, telling explicitly that sorry is content type actually not content type content type is image slash jpeg so we are telling explicitly to our uh, wcf that we are returning uh, image uh, as uh, as a stream now to make it a uh, rest enable service go ahead and open your web.config file if you are using Visual Studio 2.8, you will have a default endpoint, just disable that and if you are using 
uh, uh, two things just uh, this, uh, comment out that multiple site binding enabled equal true now open your markup of the service file and here we need to add a factory to work as a um, uh, WCF race service we make it as a race service factory equal to system dot service model dot activation dot web service host factory web service host factory sure enough so uh, I have created our WCF service I'll again explain that first I created an operation contract and here I'm I'm saying that I'm going to return an stream in the service implementation I'm saying that uh, in my outgoing response of web operation contacts that I'm returning an image of the type JPEG and then I have disabled all the endpoint uh, the default endpoint is got created through the WCF I have and I'm using the factory class system the service model dot activation dot web service host factory to enable our WCF service as a race service now just rebuild it uh, so we have a build it successfully go ahead and run your uh, service here Since uh, Internet Explorer is able to understand what is the JPG format, so we should able to get the output in the browser itself. So this is our base address, and as we see here, that we constructed that base address slash get image will give us the output slash get image, and here we are getting output in the browser. So uh, this was the purpose of this video. Just go ahead and click one more thing in your uh, service. In your uh, mm, in your service, here we are uh, saying that our content type is image slash JPEG, right? JP is the format which is understandable by the Internet Explorer browser. Just change it to some other format. Let us say ABC. What is the ABC format extension of the image? Internet Explorer does not understand. Now let's go ahead and run your service again. in browser run your service again and if you can see here is get image your internet explorer is not able to understand what is the extension abc for image so it is telling you that you want to uh, save the file if you save this file here i save that file now i save that file on my desktop if you go ahead uh, if you go there get image and open your paint Just open from your desktop just get image and here we are able to get that because in uh, no paint is able to understand or able to we can say interpret dot extension but our browser is not able to understand that what is the exactly the type ABC for the image so it was not able to uh, able to render that and it told and it uh, gave the message to, to user to uh, download or save that particular file so again if you change to the format which is understandable by your browser that's jpg you can get the output in the i itself so go ahead by default my wc client is getting open so here if you see get image we're getting output in the browser so this was the purpose of this video to show you how we can return uh, image using WCF race service. Again, I explained that I did nothing. I just get in an operation contract which is returning an stream. A stream is inside the name space system dot io. And uh, while the service implementing, I'm saying that web operation contacts dot current dot outgoing response content type is image with the extension JPEG. And thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, looking forward to meet you again.